Hi, thank you. Bo New here at 4, a special evening filled with music, dancing, and food, and it's all to help out a great cause. Doesn't get much better than that. I'm joined by Carrie Jordan and Melody Jones with Renaissance Terrace Assisted Living mm -hmm. to talk about the Renaissance Terrace Ball. This is your first one. It is. It wow, is this excited. is exciting. So mm -hmm. how did you come up with this idea? Well, we Renaissance Terrace is a nonprofit assisted living community, mm -hmm. and um, as we as we work hard every year to provide the best quality care we can at the lowest price point. Mm -hmm. um, last year, we started a conversation about what can we do, what's something else that we can do, and we decided that we would start this Bridge the Gap Fund, mm -hmm. which is a subsidy which helps to provide subsidies to bridge that gap for people to be able to afford assisted living care and community. More and more people are going to be needing assisted living Absolutely. with our baby boomers. I, I know you're already seeing some. Absolutely. Uh, so that's something to consider when we're thinking about our own futures, isn't it? It is. Um, Renaissance Terrace is owned and operated by Senior Citizens Home Assistance Service, mm -hmm. SHAZ. Shaz has been around since 1970, and we've spent a lot of time with seniors, and one of the things that we've noticed over the years is the increased need for affordable assisted living, mm -hmm. and that's the reason that we've opened Renaissance Terrace. And uh, as we opened in 2009, and since then, we've seen an increase of people who actually need assistance with mm -hmm. meeting the cost of assisted living. And after viewing that and so many people we decided that there was something we could do as a nonprofit and that is to start this fund, Bishop Rat Fund. How much fun in this fund? Yes. And I must confess <laughs> I haven't heard of an assisted living center throwing a ball. Oh. Well I think that's it's, really it's great, great for it's everybody. It's brand new and this celebration, this is our first one. Uh -huh. We will do this annually. Um, is in conjunction actually we did a um, uh, sponsored a uh, an art show for seniors mm -hmm. just this past weekend mm -hmm. was opening night mm -hmm. uh, at the Emporium for seniors from 50 to uh, 96 entered. In fact, the one who won Best in Show is 96 years old. Yeah. And um, it that. was wonderful. So the winners will be announced at the ball. Oh, the ball is going to be a lot of fun. In many ways, it's a traditional fundraising kind of fancy dancy event. Mm -hmm. But um, we have a lot of surprises. We're trying to make this a signature event for Renaissance, make it different. And um, I think that that uh, we're very proud of that. We still have some seats available if people want to attend, that's great. I was going to ask, can anyone come? If you're oh, watching yes, and absolutely. you're thinking, well, this sounds like fun. Yeah, open yes. to the public, open to the public, 100% of um, the proceeds go directly into this fund. Mm -hmm. Um, the tickets are $75. Mm -hmm. um, we have a cocktail hour, the first hour, and then dinner, and then dancing, and lots of surprises. And um, it's going to be an amazing, amazing evening. And remind us again, when and where? Saturday, July 21st at Jackson Terminal. S begins at 6 p.m. until 10 p.m. Wonderful. I've and done a lot of events there, and it's really a wonderful venue. Yes. If you're interested in buying tickets, you can go to renaissanceterrace.org. Uh, there's the opportunity to purchase tickets or make a donation to support the Bridge the Gap Fund. All mm -hmm. right. Thanks, ladies, so much for all Thank you're you. doing. We appreciate it. Thank and guess you. what? We're making it really easy for you to get tickets. If you'd like more information on the ball, go to WATE.com as well. Check the As Seen On section. We have all the links to make it, as I said, really easy to get involved.